When I heard about the Orlando shooting and the Sandy Hook tragedy, I thought they were awful and disgusting. But because they were far enough away from me, I could pretend like it wasn't as bad as it was. And because it hadn't happened to me or to people I knew that I could ignore it and, and feel okay. But after the Las Vegas shooting and because it was so close to home, it, it's, at this point for me, it's almost impossible to just pretend like this isn't something that happens and that it isn't an issue. It became painfully obvious to me that as a country, we're kind of stuck in this vicious cycle where we have a shooting, all these news anchors speak about it, everyone with their opinions on whether we should have guns, we shouldn't have guns, what should be banned, what shouldn't be, they all get shared to you know, Facebook or in conversations with your friends. And then enough time passes and we distance ourselves from the event and we stop thinking about it until it happens again. And, and I personally thought and reflected on my own views and I couldn't help but think about how much my own views didn't really matter. Because no matter how I share or explain or articulate my views, there are, there are at least five, six famous Facebook videos out there that do exactly the same thing, if not better. And then I started to think about what causes change and what actually ever gets anything done. And I remembered the documentary Super Size Me. And how a billion dollar company like McDonald's ended up changing their menus and removing the super size option altogether just because of a documentary and because one person decided to share information in a way that was an adventure and non-biased and a learning experience. And I thought to myself, is it possible to recreate that? Can it happen? I believe that it is in America's best interest to have the most unbiased documentary possible made about gun rights and gun violence in America. And my goal is to raise enough money so that I can travel and secure interviews from both sides, from avid gun owners and gun manufacturers to, you know, the most left-wing people I could find who are anti-gun and anti, you know, anything that has to do with gun ownership. Can it happen? I don't know. But one thing that I can promise is that I'm going to try everything under the sun and my absolute best to make it happen if people find that this is a project they feel is worth supporting. So... That's as much as I feel like I can talk and share about it on my own. Um, I have a lot more written, um, my own personal thoughts on how I think the documentary should go. But if you feel like this is something that would help our country and is a project that you personally want to see or something that you think is even worth doing, support the project. Um, I personally am interested in it. I want to make this happen. I feel pretty passionate about it and I know that I would be willing to put in the time and the hours and the dedication to make it happen. And I'm hoping that enough people feel the same way. So please, at the very least, check out the project and read more about the details as to what it would take to make it possible. And thank you for watching.